going to run this 500i that I ran in the nitro saw video. I put it side by side with the NAS saw and it, was, it blew it out of the water. <laughs> One thing, uh, for one, nitrous, it just, it's so ridiculous what nitrous does. I think you could put nitrous in an MS250, which is my favorite saw of all time, no joke. Uh, I love that saw. And it would, it would be a contender. I probably wouldn't hold up, but. So, I want to put a race chain on this saw and see what the difference is, because the nitrous saw was over twice as fast as this. And I bet I can bring that down because I'm guessing, this is just a total guess, I'm guessing that the chain that Cole made is 30% faster, really. Maybe even more, I don't know. But I'll put a link to Cole's uh, Instagram in the description because he does do some, you know, he'll do chains for people. I will tell you right now, they are not cheap. So if you're wondering how much they are, uh, I, would, I probably wouldn't even get a hold of them. I'm, I'm telling you, they're expensive. So. I'm going to do a run with this. Saw's already warmed up. I do have to go turn the exhaust fan on. I'm not going to cut. I'm not going to edit because I am a professional. And I don't want you guys to think I'm trying to pull something on you. I, even though I don't know what I would do. So, one thing I do have. So, I took the felling dogs off and I put, I just cut the face off of uh, this felling dogs not even for this saw. But that way, you know, if I get up against it, I can just float it down. And I'm just going to apply even pressure. You know how people are, they're going to say this, that, and the other thing. I mean, I'm cutting a piece of wood. How accurate can a guy get? So, again, saw's already warmed up. So let's get it. It is what it is. I'm still going to be cutting the same log, so I don't think it makes much of a difference. Okay, guys, now it's go time. Uh, this log's in for a hurting. I got the race chain on the 500, and I'm guessing 30%. We'll see what happens. saw that runs you know in the cut in the cut it runs like 13.5 to 14.5 depending and he basically made that chain to run that high rpms now you can notice when i started to push a little harder you're like because it started just going through like water at first i'm like oh this is gonna be ridiculous then i started pushing too hard and you hear that it bogged the saw down that's exactly what he told me it was going to happen so you got to hold it at the highest rpms you can but that was fast. I'm going to compare it to my second two cuts because that first one, that was human error. I know. I know. I made a mistake. It's kind of crazy. But I got a little bit of room. I'm going to run. Uh, I don't want to wreck this chain. I'm going to run the other chain against a stock 500. I want to see what a ported 500 versus a stock 500 would do. And that'd be a more realistic comparison because, you know, this chain, I have to send it back to him to get it resharpened and it's expensive. I don't want to. I don't want to use this chain anymore than I need to. 
still looking good though. It looks it looks clean yet. I threw it on the nitrous saw and I was I about I didn't care about anything that happened. Uh, when I ran that nitrous saw, I busted a bar stud that time. That's why in the video there was sparks flying off the chain. I think that was I think that bar stud busted instantly, like you know, basically as soon as I revved it up. Uh, it wasn't broke when I put the bar and chain on. I know that, but yeah, it wasn't the best for the chain, so kind of sucks. But I'm curious to see what happened. I'll do a I'll give you the times on the cuts, and then I'll do another side by side. And that was ridiculous. All right, let me get a stock 500i, get some fuel in it, get it warmed up, and cut a couple more cookies. stock 500 I'm actually yikes man that's that's crazy and there we go that shows you this is not some like balsa wood this stuff is pretty hard uh, you can hear that I was pushing hard enough to bog the saw down I did that on purpose I figure if I didn't people would be like oh you're not pushing hard enough or you're trying to sandbag the saw 100% I was not uh, actually let me dog in for one cut I want to see if that makes much of a difference. Yeah, that seemed faster, uh, but I didn't dog in with the other cut, so... Damn! I'm happy with those results. Thank you, Cole. Thank you, Joe. I'm going to put a link to Joe. Uh, he's the one that gave me the test logs. These are perfect. Uh, I'm glad I didn't get something that was stupid soft, like some really soft pine. That would have been, I'm probably yelling because I got my mops on. That would have been, the nitrous saw went through that, what, this log in like, what, two seconds maybe? So it would, it would have been stupid. Um, perfect. I love it. I know not to set it back outside though. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Nothing goofy, no crazy antics this time. Trust me, I'll get you on the next one. I'll do something really stupid. <laughs>